Hey guys, going to lose 57 here. Finally doing another episode of Let's Play Pokemon Blue. Last time, we got the Fuchsia City. And King Boo grew to level 25. And yeah. So, we're going to trade and make him evolve into a Gengar. So, and then I'm going to level grind him up and we'll get him back to the level 32 range of all my Pokemon. Now, I am doing this on an emulator, and I am going to show you how to an It's very hard. You need a program. Uh, I forget the name of it. I'll tell you guys in a little bit. But what you need to do is here, I'll drag down my um, menu. So you see the menu here? You, you need to first, you need to export the battery file by doing this. This will go to, um, I'll tell you what the program's called in a few minutes. Okay, emulators. The, it's called TGPDU. TGBDU. You want to just export it to here. There. I exported it. Then you want to go into your other game. Yeah, I'm going to have to go into um my other game, Pokemon, right now. So I'm going to pause and we're going to get to there. Okay guys, I'm in my other file, and I got my Pokemon, all set, and everything. So now, what you want to do is pretty much the same exact thing. You want to export battery file. And then you want to go here, go to the, we can go to the TGB2 file. And you have here, mine's in a different spot than yours. And just save. Okay. See you guys back in a bit when I do the next part. Of what you do. Okay, I got my um explorer open now. And I got the TBG TGB do file open. And crap. One of them didn't save. I just really curiously want to open this. Oh, there's a save. You want to add it there. There. Huh? Why does it give me an error? That's really weird. Dot save. I don't know. I'll be back after I troubleshoot in a little bit. Okay guys, I was doing it completely wrong. First off, you can't really have it of the two same games. And this is Pokemon Red. You see actual Pokemon Blue and Pokemon Blue, you can't really do it that way. So I'm just going to go in here to TBG2 and save. Mm, okay, now I'm going to close out of this. So we don't need that right now. We don't need um Virtual Boy. That's the emulator I use. So go back here, and we first we want to copy Pokemon Blue, and then we need to go to here. Oh, whoops, wrong thing. But we need to go to here, and go to Media, and hit Paste. Then we need to go back into here and get Pokemon Blue. So copy, paste. And I went back too far again. Base. Oh, I did blue twice. Derp. Making all sorts of silly mistakes. Where's Pokemon Red? Right here. Copy. Did it again. Went too far, but... As you can see, I this is how you do it. Now this is the first time I've ever traded in Demo Earth, I didn't even know you could. So yeah. This is pretty cool. Now you go put these in save. Now one of these has to be named SA2. So you wanna rename it and hit two. If you can't find extensions, this way to find it. This file might become unusable, hit yes. Now you wanna launch TBG dual. 
Yeah, let's minimize this. So I can see. So we can make it fit the video. Look at all my desktop items. Yeah, my desktop's pretty crazy. Okay, so now you want to hit CB1 load. Then you go into media and hit Pokemon Blue. Why is it not working? I think I might have. N I think I figured out the issue. First, I just want to check the controls. Okay, delete and end is A and B. Okay. I just want to change this to W A S A and D. Yeah, that's a good control. You need another control for both the games. So um. Now I just want to load media. Try this one. Why does it not work? Oh, let's look in here. I hate when stuff never works for me. Oh. It should be Pokemon Blue. Not red. Because you have to you load the first one that isn't the SA2 because it needs to read both of the files. So I'll just go load. Why is it not working? Oh come on! I really want to do this. You see, reset, load, bam. I don't know. I'm gonna pause the video for. I quickly found my issue. Let's get that up. They wanted this, not the zip. Well, I usually just load it with my zips and. You know, it usually works fine on Visual vir Visual Boy. Why do I always call it Virtual Boy? That's a shitty console. Whatever. I think this will work now. Let's just try it. GB. Yep, that's open. No CB2. And that's open. So you can see we got both of our games. And it sounds really weird both of mine. And Pokemon Red. Now I probably really just screwed myself because I closed that. Yep, I'm gonna have to start a new game. One second, I'm gonna pause. Okay, I'm back. Stupid me. Oh, I should turn my phone back on. Or stupid me forgot to save. And yeah, so you really wanted to save in front of the video? No, I'm not in front of the video. I don't know. Well, yeah, this is my first time, so bear with me. Guys, I'm sorry for, like, messing up a lot of this. But, okay, bear with me. But yeah, you want to save before you export the files. Okay? So now these are two linked together, so now if we talk. Welcome to the Cable Club. Fly here. Fly here. Yes. Bam. Trade center. Wanna go into the trade center? And okay. Now you both are in the trade center. And you get this guy facing. Just a moment. I love this song. I don't know. I just always like this one. When I trade, I always like with humming it, and my friends got too mad at me. But yeah, we want to trade Haunter, because Haunter is one of the few Pokemon that evolve when you trade. Some of the Pokemon that evolve when you trade are... Um... Gravelers and... Cadabras into Alakazams and Golems. Okay. Charmander and Haunter will be traded. Okay, multitasking. And here we go. Basically, sing goodbye to the Pokemon. The scene's always cool. So basically, there would be a cable that would link between the two Game Boys that you trade. You'd have to buy them. Definitely did not come. And they're pretty cool. I had one. I was kid. I used a lot. My friends from the bus. Bus. We used to trade. That's pretty cool. Now, um, Charmander's being sent over. I 
had no clue you'd do this. So this is one of my first time. It's really cool that you can do this on emulators. Boom, 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 boom. What? King Boo is evolving? King Boo evolved into Gengar. Yeah, that's pretty awesome. Now we want to get... Okay, we'll send Charmander back. And we want to get Gengar. So we're going to have to retrade. And I hit stats. I always did this as a kid. That would drive me up a wall. Like, I would do that so often. Why do I have to put stats before trading? Okay, now we need to... Get Charmander. Trade. And... Yeah, Charmander. Trade. Trade, trade, trade. So I hope this explains how to trade on emulators for you guys and helped you out. And it's a pretty cool video. Now this is probably gonna be the whole video of trading, but it's gonna be cool. And the Pokemon be trade back. I don't see why they could have traded couldn't have traded the two Pokemon at the same time, but I don't know. Okay, Gengar is being traded. Gengar is really strong and pretty sweet. I'm glad I have this because I can trade in future games for future trade evolution Pokemon. And there's a lot of good ones. Most of the good ones have trade ev evolutions. Hey Gengar. Now the trade is complete. Now you may be wondering how to get your save file back into it so you don't have to use this really bad emulator. I agree with you, this is a bad emulator. How do I leave here? I don't remember. Did you just turn your game off? Please tell me no. Please tell me no. Oh, exit. There we go. Oh, wait. Did you just reset? I feel like I just screwed that all up. Okay, I'm standing in front of here. Oh! Okay, I have King Blue back. Stats. Yeah, it's again gone. So now we want to close out of this. Bam, that's closed out of. Now we want to go back into... Here. No, that's my Minecraft saves. Hmm, did I close out of that? Yes, I did. So we just oh, there we go. So now we want to go in here, open up Visual Boy. It's pretty cool. Now we want to open Pokemon Blue. L open. And we go in here. Emulators. GB. That's the folder I have in here. You no, know, you you'll be a little different. It depends on where you save for you. Pokemon Blue. Get this full screen. And like that. And we'll get rid of. No, we'll show this still. And now you want to. Now instead of. Instead of export, you want to import it. So import battery file. And you need to just go in here. To emulators back into the TGBDO file. Go into saves. And yeah, this one. You get some weird error, but it's all cool and it starts st st to work. Now load up your Pokemon version. Continue. One blue. And we're here. And yeah! We evolved that Gengar in this part. Hope this explained a lot of cool stuff for you. You got training, and it's pretty cool to show this in LP. Most LPs don't even have training. So I'm going on with seven, and I hope you liked this video. And I just want to check one thing, and it, maybe if you guys didn't have any questions on this question like I do, then we'll see. Because I just want to see, when I open this again, will it still be on that save? Okay. Oh. Oh. Okay. Yeah, by name. 
I thought I screwed up all my listing of them. Okay, so will this work again? Or will I have to import it every time? Because I don't want to be able to do that. And I'll probably find a better way to do it. I'm pretty sure it's going to work. Yep. And it works. So I'm going to 157. Signing off.